Megan. I'm Leah. I'm Carrie. And we are nutrition educators from UMass Extension SNAP Ed program. And we work in Fall River and other communities throughout Massachusetts to help families stretch their food dollar a little further by making smart and healthy food choices. So today we just wanted to bring you a really quick and easy healthy snack. And we are going to do some popcorn. And when you think of popcorn, what do you like movie theater popcorn? Yeah. But yeah, so kind of salty, kind of buttery. So this is something you can make at home. But again, it's a little bit healthier, a little bit smarter of options. So what are some of the things we're putting on our popcorn today, Leah? So some things are some canola oil, basil leaves, garlic powder, and parsley leaves, and also some salt. And we have the kernels for the popcorn. All right, so we have a hot air popper right here that we are making our popcorn in, but there are alternative methods if you don't have this at home. But you can also place the popcorn kernels just like this inside a paper bag at home. Just lay them flat on the bottom of the bag, fold over the bag, and stick it in the microwave. And then we open it up, and we have our popcorn right inside. Would you like a piece? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so first we're just going to pop our kernel so we have the popcorn to start with. And now that we got our popcorn, we are going to add some seasoning to it, give it a little bit of flavor. Get the last couple of kernels. <laughs> you can use olive oil or vegetable oil, but we choose to use canola oil. Just just a little bit on, just to kind of help all the flavors stay together. And then we're going to put some of our seasoning in. The first that um, Megan is adding is one tablespoon of basil. Next is garlic powder that Megan is adding right now. Um, it is a half a teaspoon. And then it's parsley leaves. One tablespoon. You can also chop these up or buy them in a container already. And then just a little bit of salt at the end. And the great thing about this is you don't need a lot of salt because you are using so many other herbs and seasoning in this. And then we're just going to mix this together, spread the flavor out. We hope that you enjoyed our show and we'll try our recipe. If you did try our recipe, snap a photo and please share it using hashtag cookfr. You will be entered into a raffle to win um, an Eating Smart Be Active cookbook.